Alrighty, Chef Buck here. Today I'm cooking up a little linguine with white clam sauce. This is one of my go-to dishes when I don't have a lot of fresh ingredients in the house. Because I always got some onions and garlic and I usually keep some chopped clams. And for this recipe, I'm going to use three cans. And the first thing you want to do is you want to separate the liquid from the clams. You know, go ahead and put those in separate bowls. Then heat you up a skillet on medium heat and we're going to melt a half a stick of butter and then we're going to add one half cup of olive oil. You know, kind of let that heat up and then we're going to throw in some chopped onions and a little bit of garlic. Now I go a little heavy on the garlic but you can cut back here. But garlic, you know, you can't go wrong with too much garlic. So go ahead and brown that garlic up. You know, let it, let it get a little bit of color to it. But watch your temperature because you don't want to burn it. But once, you know, once it starts to color, we're going to throw in one cup of white wine. Now use a dry white wine. You don't want to use a sweet wine. Then we're going to let that simmer for about five or ten minutes, you know, and let it reduce down a little bit. Now once it's reduced down, we can go ahead and add a little bit of chicken broth. I'm going to put about a half a quart in there. Then we're going to put in the clam juice from our cans and then a little bit of herbs and spices you know now I like to put some red pepper flakes in here and I go a little heavy on the red pepper flakes because I like a little kick but you don't have to put that much put a little bit of black pepper in there and a little bit of dried oregano now if you wanted to you could go ahead and add your little dried parsley here as well now get that mixed up and you're gonna let it simmer on a low heat for about 20 minutes and while that's simmering we'll go ahead and we'll, we'll cook our linguine. So, so let it simmer for about five minutes because it's not gonna take 20 minutes to cook your linguine, but time it so that when the 20 minutes is up on, on your sauce, your linguine will be finished. So at the end of the 20 minutes, we're gonna go ahead and throw our clams in there. You know, that's, that's one of the last things you add. So get your clams in there, stir it up, and then we'll go ahead and we'll turn the heat off on the skillet and the linguine because if you got your timing right your linguine is done and you'll just be able to pull it right out of the pot and put it in the skillet so don't rinse your linguine don't don't drain it don't do any of that stuff you know because like i said you know in another video of mine you don't want to waste that flavor you know you don't want to wash the flavor off your pasta so just throw it right in the sauce and get it all stirred up now we're going to add some parmesan cheese now you can put a half cup to three quarters of a cup and I usually usually stir it in about a quarter cup at a time so just throw your parmesan cheese in there give it a stir and then that's it you know you're good to go you know if you want you can chop up some fresh parsley on there you know to make it look pretty but at this point you know it's it's time to chow down but that's it give it a try let me know what you think and bon appetit mm -hmm. All right, there's a full recipe down in the description, you know, so give it a try. Uh, if you want a different linguine dish, you know, there's shrimp linguine right up there. You can click on that, you know, so thanks for watching. And, uh, you know, whatever. Do you hear that bird outside?